So the notification for the first MBA entrance exam for 2020 is out and NMAT has yesterday come out with its notification with a lot of changes. So in this short video, I'm going to take you through what are the changes in the new pattern of NMAT. So the registration for NMAT 2020 starts on 1st August and the window for examination starts from October 6th and it goes on till December 19th. And during this period of time, you can write this exam three times in an interval of 15 days and that all remains the same. But there are major changes in the examination and that's what we will discuss here. And these major changes will actually change the way that we look at NMAT and we will have to re-strategize this exam and look forward how we can better crack this examination. So change number one, the structure of exam. So there are three sections. You have the verbal ability section, the quantitative ability section and the logical reasoning section. That remains the same, but there are changes in the number of questions and amount of time. Now, in all the three sections, you have equal number of questions, 36. But in the verbal ability section, you get 28 minutes to solve it. Logical reasoning, 40 minutes. And in quantitative ability, you have 52 minutes to solve it. Also, what is to be kept in mind here is the entire examination now has moved on from a computer based examination to a computer adaptive exam which means it's more like a GMAT exam where you will keep on getting questions and based on your performance as to how you do those questions, the next question may be easier or tougher or at the same level. So if you do your question correctly, you may get the next question uh, as a tougher question or of the same level. If you do the question wrong, then probably you'll get a next question which is the same level of question or you'll get a question which is easier than the level that you are at right now. So basically this test is going to adapt to your performance and give you questions based on your level of performance and judge you based on how good you are in terms of your proficiency of these three sections. Now, earlier in the NMAT examination, every question was of three marks. There were 120 questions. Now, 108 questions, 36 questions in each section. And the scaling of marks is what will be done instead of straight three marks for each question, which means each section is scaled from 12 marks to a total of 120 marks. So which means you can get marks anywhere between 12 and 120 for each of these sections. So the minimum score that you can get is 36 and the maximum that you can get is 360. Now the last change in this entire paper is about the way they are going to conduct this paper. So earlier NMAT used to be conducted across a window of 75 to 80 days. And during this time you can go and write the exam. The result used to come after about a month or 15 days after writing the exam. It was not fixed. Now, in the new pattern, you'll be getting the result after 48 hours of writing this exam, which makes scheduling of your retakes much more easier. So big changes on NMAT and keep tuning into our channel and we'll come out with more updates about NMAT 2020 as we go forward. So thank you very much. All the best for your NMAT 2020 preparation.